Happy birthday to you, dear James Lowe. It's a song I sing from my heart. May all your blessings come true for all the things that you do. Happy birthday to you, dear James Lowe. <laughs> I just love how you show me how a true man should be, should act, should live, and how a man who's walking with God, like anything is possible. I thank you that from when I was younger to what I'm now and to what I'm going to be, you just tell me what I am and you repeat it over and over and over again. I wouldn't be here if I didn't, if you didn't stay in that fight with me, so I thank you. He always finds the courage to give Jesus his very best yes, even when the stakes are high. Remember that fight that we had in my garage not too long ago? If I can fight you and we still cool, then you're a real friend of me. So <laughs> fight your friends, see how it pans out. This man's still my friend, I love you forever. God bless you. But we started this friendship, tough time for pastors, and then Pastor James said, would you come walk with me? Uh, and so started walking with him and saw what God was doing through Unite and through reconciliation in the city. And I was like, I'll walk with you every time you come out here. You know, he's disrupting the division between whites and blacks. You know, one thing I love about you is that when it's bad and ugly, you ain't running from it, but you run into it. And I appreciate right. you for doing That's that. Right. And it you. was in the moment that you were praying, I never told you this, but when you were praying, it was a signal to me from God that we were gonna be all right. I've had a, the privilege of experiencing your leadership for the past decade. And the ABCs of the attributes that you bring are rooted in being ambitious, being brilliant, and being courageous. We um, are grateful for you. We're grateful for who you are for this city, but who you are for this nation. And so in the city of Nashville in our country, basically what you're doing is just saying, that don't belong there. It doesn't matter what it looks like. Keep standing on his word. Hey. When somebody looks around to see the division and the polarization, Pastor James Lowe is going to be in the middle of that, uh, finding common ground and bringing people together. No one ever said it would be easy. They said it would be worth it. And for all that you do, I know it's difficult listening to everyone talk about you. It's definitely worth it what you're doing.